This program brings out the best of our students. They interact with each other, they follow directions, they um, are their own person with their own drum in front of them and whatever sounds they make, it's their individual sound. Music happens to be a common bond that draws this group of children with this instructor together and you can see it through the energy and just the process of the class right away. It seems very simple. You're, you know, people might look at it and say, well, you're banging on a drum. But you're, like I said, you're using the drum as a vehicle and it's, it's a different vehicle than just trying to get them to talk all the time or trying to get them to do something else. So it allows these kids to come in and be less inhibited, allows them to, you know, sit with like-minded kids and, and do things to, and, you know, try to push a collective goal to where they could all play together. Great, but let's get a little bit more dynamic there, okay? Seeing the joy on the kids' faces and seeing them master a task that they might not have been able to do a week or so before makes everything worthwhile. Every Tuesday and Wednesday when the secretary at the front office makes the announcement for all of the students to come up for the drumming program, they run up here. And they sit, they know what seats they have and whatever, and they just perform for the whole 45 to 50 minutes. I think one of the things we have a, a blessing somewhat is in a school like here, in like Leonard Kurtz, or in Fairhaven, it's not quite about an achievement test or a, an, you know, an assessment. It's, you're looking at the whole child, socially, physically, mentally, education. You get to look at the whole child. It, and you know different individuals have different abilities and just because some of our students are disabled doesn't mean they're not abled or more apt to be drawn towards music. When Bill and Dan retired, they had been friends lifelong friends through their love of music. So the two of them decided in retirement to do a project together and came up with the fact that quite often special needs children don't have advocates for them that can vet music. And they um, formed a nonprofit and they vet music programs for various different disabilities and bring them to the educational institutes at no cost. We are using the rhythms of the drum to try to help with language skills. So a lot of times um, we equate words, like we did names today, and sometimes I have word cards and we do other words with rhythms on the drum. So it's kind of like a self-reinforcing cycle. You learn the word, you learn the rhythm, you do them together, so you're learning to read, you're learning more language skills, but you're also learning more musical skills because when you hear that rhythm, you might think of the word. When you hear the word, you think of the rhythm. And so it kind of reinforces it. Um, and we do picture cards sometimes too, so they can look at the pictures and have a visual and come up with the word and use the drum to help them get the word out. Uh, Tony is great with them. <laughs> she um, knows all their personalities and she quickly learned all their names and what each individual was like. So she knows who to kid with and who to kind of back off a little bit with. She, again, with academics, she's picked up very easily on who can do what. Put your hands back down, but don't move them, okay? We're going to count backwards, all right? So that smile is all you really know as to how they're happy, you know, and to see them come in here every day and even start off in a bad day, because some kids do, and have them leave happy because, you know, they were part of the team, and, you know, they like, maybe they liked hanging out with me, and, you know, just, it's just something that they enjoy doing, so. It's, it's great. It's, it's, it's the most rewarding thing I've ever done. They participate in our talent show. We have a talent show every year. And so they do a number in our talent show, which is really nice. Then all the parents get to see what they're doing in the drum program. 
The teachers and administrators love the program. They're thrilled that their children are getting to participate in an extracurricular activity, which is not normally the case for them. Quite often, with the cuts to music and the arts in all school programs, especially for the handicapped, they're left by the wayside quite a bit. So they are thrilled to death that these programs are coming to the school. The children are thrilled to be a part of them. Um, it's just a positive win-win for everyone. My goal uh, and this program kind of align. It's enriching the kids' lives with music appreciation and a way to express themselves.